Hi, I'm Julius, and I will go over device types and traits for smart home. Device types and traits are modular, but there are some traits that make more sense to apply on certain devices, like brightness trait for a light versus adding it to a vacuum. Once these types and traits are specified, we can bring the devices into HomeGraph using Sync Intent. HomeGraph is a database which enables Google to build a topology of user smart devices in their home. Traits help you expose functionality of a device to the assistant. They are used to represent the core features of the device. Here we have a smart light that isn't so smart since it doesn't have any traits yet. We add the on off trait and now we can turn the light on and off and ask if the light is turned off by simply asking, are the lights on in the kitchen? We add in brightness so we control the intensity of the light by saying, make the lights dimmer. By adding in the color setting, we can now control the color of the smart light with Google Assistant. We can make the living room lights purple, and voila, the lights are purple. Within a trait are trait attributes. It lets Google Assistant know, in this example, that the smart light supports RGB color mode instead of HSV, and that its maximum brightness is 6500K. Please review each trait's device attributes as some are required to be stated in the sync response. Here is how they would be sent in the sync response. This has been Device Types and Traits. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe to be notified for future content.